Hello guys and gals, today the Volkswagen T5 Transporter, the beast, removing the door panel. So if you've got problems, um, say with your speaker in the door or the electric window switch, or you need to um, just get access to it because there's something inside you need to get to, then this will show you how to do it. So there's two screws underneath that handle at the top, and then we've got one in the middle here, and then we've got three at the bottom. So one, a two, three. So first of all, you need to get this handle off. So just, I wouldn't advise using a metal screwdriver. You're probably best off using a bit of plastic or a special plastic trim tool. So just prise it off and you've got two screws down there which need removing. So let's just remove those first. Obviously anti-clockwise to undo, but we all know that. I'm just using a uh, magnetic screwdriver, so once the screw is out, it will stick to the screwdriver. Voila! Put that down inside the van, and then let's remove the other one. But we don't need to see this at full speed, so let's speed this up. So that's those two removed. And for the other, the other four screws in the door panel, you're going to need one of these tamper-proof bits. I can't remember what the size is, but obviously if you've got the whole set, then just match one up. So let's just remove one of these. Again, make sure you've got a nice good fit because you don't want to shear it. Okay, so let's start removing this one. Okay, there's one. So keep these all together, just put them in a little tray. And then we've got another two here. So let's just remove those quickly. And then we've got one in the middle. And that's exactly the same, the tamper proof bit. So let's just remove that one as well. Make sure it's a nice good fit. So this is the last one of the door panel. Let's just speed this up. Okay, so now that is all the screws out. Now, the next thing you have to do, obviously, is just lift away the door panel. Now, you do have to be a bit forceful with this, and it's very hard to do that and film it and do it with one hand. In fact, it's nigh on impossible. So what you do, first of all, just take this, remove this handle. It just slides off gently because the bolts are out. And then we need to remove the whole inner tray. So what you need to do is just kind of pull it out and lift it up. And you will have to be quite forceful with this. And unfortunately, you probably will break a few of the clips. So I'm just going to jump ahead here. So this is the electric window switch. So as you lift the door panel up and away, do not just pull it away from you really quickly. You need to unclip the electric window switch and also unclip the hook, which goes onto the door handle to open the door. Make sure you do that before you lift the whole panel away. But you just have to trust me that I did get it off. Unfortunately, my glamorous assistant was, um, I don't know, in the bath. So anyway, this is the inside of the door panel, just to show you what is on the inside. So we've got various clips. I mean, it might be worth ordering some of those clips as spares before you remove the door panel, just in case any of them break. But obviously you can get them from your local Volkswagen dealer, if any of them break. Obviously as plastic gets older, it does get brittle. So this is just a view of what's on the inside. So now let's go to the actual door panel and show you what's on the inside. So what we've got here is we've got the obviously the electric window switch and that is to actually open the door. So if you hold onto that plastic sheath and just pull that lever, uh, that will open the door. 
and there we've got the main speaker. Now the reason I've taken the door panel off is because I've had a problem with that main speaker. The actual speaker stopped working, i.e. blew up. Now unfortunately with the Volkswagen speakers, they're not bolted in, they're actually pot rivets. So you, if you want to replace this, you have to actually drill those out and pull the speaker out and put a new speaker in and then obviously um, put your own bolts in. So that's the end. Thanks for watching. To put the door panel on, it's just a reversal of that video. So you can watch it backwards. So thanks for watching, guys and girls. Hey, careful, man. There's a beverage here, huh?